Jamrin developers this is Jamrin guys so 10th tutorial in this tutorial we'll be creating an awesome loading screen for our web view so without wasting time let's create our new project here we are going to create a new project and we'll see a lot of options now we're writing code for cross platform so we are going to make a multi-platform app give it a name as awesome web view and click on ok and give it a shared project as I am using a live player we need to first of all go to our project here we will be specifically talking about root project not other project that are basically targeting specific operating system like android as well as ios so i'll be minimizing them inside our shared project we have two pages they are app.jml as well as main page.jml inside app page we have app.jml as well as app.jml.code behind inside app.jml.code behind it's an area where we are evaluating our app to start from the position here main page is a page holder which contains the page to be loaded that means our main page will be our starting point to any work now let us design our main page by placing absolute layout in our previous session we have already discussed about absolute as well as stack layout here I'll be placing stack layout inside my absolute layout and I'll be calling web view and giving an event handler as navigating as well as navigated what to do after our page gets navigated as well as navigating. This piece of code will be my loading screen. Here I'll be calling a stack layout and giving a label as loading, color as white and background as gray as well as is visible as true and this frame will be called before my page gets loaded. Inside code behind of main page.jml part, I have already initialized browser inside my web view so that I can give its source to exact destination. Then the web view will load that page. These are my event handlers that I will be calling when my page gets navigated as well as during the time of navigation. Here I have placed navigating is equals to web on navigating as well as web on navigating as my events and I'll be calling over here as during the time of loading then it will be visible as well as it will not be visible after it gets navigated let's build our project let's run our project I have used physical device and reflecting using visor now our page is being loaded my page is heavy as I am loading GIF images. Let's wait for our output. It is giving a beautiful UI and this code is applicable for both Android as well as iOS as I am using cross platform. Our loading frame doesn't go till my web page is 100% loaded. Let's wait for its completion. It is still being loaded. Okay, it's already loaded. Thanks guys. Thanks for watching. There are many tutorials that will come ahead. Stay tuned guys.